हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सुरेश अग्रवाल्स मैथमेटिक्स शॉर्टकट्स ये वन स्टॉप फॉर लर्निंग ऑल द शॉर्ट ट्रिक्स रिक्वायर्ड फॉर कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जाम्स इन दिस वीडियो आई शेल बी टेकिंग अप द डिफिकल्ट टॉपिक ऑफ फाइंडिंग द स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ सिक्स डिजिट नंबर्स अप टू फाइव डिजिट्स आई हैव पुट लॉट ऑफ वीडियोज दिस इज द एक्सक्लूसिव ट्रिक इन विच आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू हाउ टू फाइंड स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ सिक्स डिजिट नंबर्स all these short tricks are a part of the exclusive ebook of short tricks you can go for a copy of this because this is what is required to crack all the competitions it comes along with the video support amazing reasoning pdf being uh, bought out by the channel so grab a copy whatsapp 9896369963 that's the number it's the only medium through which you can get a copy of this exclusive ebook Let's see the problem in hand. Here you can see we have a six-digit number four one eight six zero nine. So if you make pairs of this number from the right hand side, we have three pairs. So my answer is going to be a three-digit number. But when we find square roots, we always have two possibilities. Look at the last pair. Zero nine ends with nine. Which single-digit square ends with nine? Three square is nine. And seven square is forty-nine. Both end with nine. Therefore, there are two possibilities at the unit place. Now look at the first two digits, forty-one. Which is the perfect square which lies very close to forty-one but just below it? It is six square, thirty-six. So that six forms the first digit. Now the middle digit. That's the only tricky step here. so what do i have to do here see 41 is the first pair i took 36 which was below 41 so just subtract these two you get 5 and the middle pair now it comes into play just write 86 the middle pair along with this 5 and now i need to perform a small step of long division 6 was the first digit double of 6 is 12 and now i need to find a digit here like 121 multiplied by 1 which should get me close to 586 now 121 into 1 is very much less than that 122 into 2 again it's very much less than that 123 into 3 let's try 124 into 4 this will be 16 6 1 carry 9 and 4 But if I take 125 into 5, it will be much above 586. So 124 into 4. So 4 is the digit which is selected as the middle digit. So now you have two possibilities: 643 or 647. Now which one is the correct answer? Digit sum method is going to help us out here. Or you can have the Vedic method of squaring numbers ending with 5 also. So I'll use that here. The number in between 643 and 647 is 645. Let's find the square of 645. How do you do that? Forget this 5 because any number ending with 5, its square ends with 25. Only thing is 64 multiplied by its consecutive number 65. 54 to 20, 02 carry. Then this is 30, 54, 56, 6, 5 carry. And 36 plus 5 is 41, so 416025 is the square of 645. Now our number 418609 is greater than this number, so our answer is also the greater one. So the answer for this question is 647. Friends, I know so many steps involved here. If you fear long division, then this can be. one of the alternatives through which you can find the square root of such numbers friends if you like this video do share it with all your friends who are struggling in the square roots concept do share it with them do subscribe the channel and click the bell shaped icon for getting all the notifications thanks for watching this video